Everyone is aware that a therapist cannot disclose patients' details, experiences and thoughts without the patient's consent. Well then, imagine sharing what you thought was a private conversation with your therapist, only to discover it's being searchable on Bing, on Google and DuckDuckGo. That sort of thing happened with Elon Musk's Grok, AI chatbot from XAI, which estimated that 370,000 private chats were accidentally suddenly published for including some deeply alarming content, you know, specific passages offered instructions for bomb making, drug production, and even an assassination plot, all indexed for anyone to find. You know, this kind of incident highlights a persistent blind spot in AI design. Features built for convenience, like, you know, Grok's share button, can dangerously blur lines between private and public data. You know, users thought they were safely sharing transcripts with their friends, not broadcasting them to the world. Additionally, in light of this, marketers have started to exploit this visibility, which only amplifies the risk. You know, and this isn't kind of a one-off. Similar lapses happened, you know, and plagued ChatGPT, Meta AI, demonstrating that the issue is not just an edgy design ethos, but a broader weakness in AI where kind of user privacy has become an afterthought. And, you know, the Grok, Grok privacy spill isn't just kind of a PR blunder. It's a trust crisis for AI adoption. Users, you know, expect confidentiality when interacting with, a, with AI assistants. When that trust is broken, the reputational damage ripples across industries already wary you know, of deploying AI in sensitive environments. So, it will be interesting to hear your thoughts, guys. What do you think? Do you think that privacy blunders and these kind of breaches, are they making you hesitant implementing AI in production systems? What steps do you think we need to make in order to prevent this from happening in the future? And most importantly, guys, stay safe out there.